Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when Fate Samurai Remnant game is not saving on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. So if you have any third part party antivirus like Avast, Noton, Bitdefender, McAfee, Komodo, Trend Micro, whichever antivirus program you have, make sure that you allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. Now, if you're using Windows security, then open Windows settings. Now, if you have Windows 11, click on privacy and security. In Windows 10, click on update and security. In Windows 10, you will find an option update and security. Click on it, then click on Windows security. In Windows 11, click on privacy and security and then click on Windows security. Now, click on virus and threat protection. Now, scroll down. At the end here, you can see manage ransomware protection. Click on it. Now click on allow an app through control folder access. Click on yes to allow. Now click on add an allowed app. Now click on browse all apps. Now go to the game installation folder. If the game is installed in C drive, open C drive, program files x86, open the Steam folder. Now open the Steam apps folder. Now open the common folder. Over here you will find the game folder. In my case it's in D drive. So open Steam folder, Steam apps common and then open the game folder and now select, select the game exe file now click on open once the game is added over here now type in control panel in window search box and then click on control panel and then click on system and security now click on windows defender firewall now click on allow an app or feature through windows defender firewall now click on change settings on the top now click on allow another app now again go to the game installation folder select the game exe file now click on open and then click on add over here now in my case it's already added so in your case if it's not added add it now once the game is added over here now you can click on ok and then launch the game and then check still the game is not saving in that case disable steam cloud now this has worked for many players so it might work for you so make a right click on the game select properties and then turn off the option which says keeps game saves in the steam cloud turn this off whenever you want to enable it you can always enable this but this has worked for a few players you can give it a try if that does not work you can always enable it. so disable it and then launch the game and then check next step is to delete the save folder in documents even if the game is not saving still you can go to documents over here and open this folder and here you can see the game save file now once you delete it you will lose all the progress and anyway the game is not saving right so you can you will lose you have to start everything from scratch so make a right click and then click on delete once this is deleted now you can launch the game and then check now the next step is to close onedrive or google drive now this is important so if you have one drive open in your windows computer then you can make a right click on google drive over here and then click on quit one drive close one drive make sure one drive is not running when you launch the game and also if you have google drive close google drive or if you have any kind of cloud save application just close it and then launch the game because the game is saving in one drive or google drive so close one drive next step is to make sure windows username does not have any special character now for this open file explorer go to this pc open c drive open users folder over here make sure that it does not have any kind of special character i have it one that is underscore so if you have percentage uh, hash or any kind of special character make sure that it does not have that in that case you can create a new account so you can go to windows settings then go to accounts and then you can go to um, other uh, other users and then click on add account over here and then uh, i don't if you don't want to use microsoft account click on i don't have this person signing information and then click on add a user without a microsoft account then you can name it whatever you want and you can enter the password if you want to 
and answer your secure security questions so this is just an example so you select your question and then answer your security questions and i'm doing it as an, as an example so click on next and once the account is created click on this down arrow and then click on change account type and then select administrator over here and then click on ok and then go to a uh, start menu and then click on the account name and then select the new newly created account so you can go to this account you can enter the password login and after you log in if you have to reinstall the game reinstall the game and then launch the game and then check now next step is to verify the game file so make a right click on the game select properties go to install files and then click on verify integrity of game files after the verification launch the game so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to save the game successfully so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel